So what does jealousy feel like to you? Yeah, I don't get jealous. I get revenge. Oh, I'm a cancer, so I can't really relate. I don't get jealous. So to me, jealousy feels like a shockwave over my entire body, then little slightly painful tickles in my side, and then red heat bubbling up from my stomach all the way to my face, and then I want to murder. Right, 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 I can relate to that. Feelings of jealousy sometimes come from insecurity, and insecurity manifests into something totally different. So your brain tries to make sense of it. Well, if I feel bad about myself, it's obviously logical that someone has done something to make me feel that way. Duh. Well, and if my partner wants to sleep with someone else, the only reason is because I'm not good enough, smart enough, hot enough, or the best in bed. Well. Before I started to like obsessively research and recognize feelings in my own body, I guess I would get jealous, but I wouldn't really recognize the feeling right away. I would basically pretend the jealousy wasn't there and then wouldn't even realize it till I was like 100% acting out. I can tell you don't love me anymore because you just texted someone. What? Or I would like, hey, do you know where my collection of Nike Dunks is? Yeah, I burned them all. And then one time, excuse me, um, who is Jessa and why are you excited to see her? My friend from college and because I haven't seen her in a long time. Oh, well, I'm mad. Guess which one of those clones I relate to. Why are you on your phone? Because I want to be. If you really loved me, you'd be paying attention to me. Oh, cute theory, but I love best fiends. So I'm on my phone paying attention to them. Wow, you love a game more than me. Look, I don't know you. We're both just clones of Stevie. Fair. What's the game? Best fiends, like friends without the R. But what is it? A free adventure puzzle game. More info. The game, which I'm winning, is best fiends, where you run around and build a team of cute fiends to defeat the uncute slugs by matching colors and keep winning for a billion or so levels. But can you play later and be with me right now? Mm, technically no, because there's an Easter egg hunt going on right now and I love a theme. So I'm gonna be focused on collecting all 12 eggs because if you collect all 12, you get prizes, see? Oh, you said prizes, so I care now. Yeah, download it. Here's a link so you can have $5 worth of gold and diamonds for free. You're welcome in advance for the leg up. Can I just play yours? Nope. Wow. Mm, my lives are precious to me and I'm on level 60 billion, so I will not allow you to jeopardize that. I'll give you a hint though. A hint? To find this Easter egg, try looking for something that Granny Slug is proud of. Oh, is her grandbaby slug coming out of the closet? No, don't think too much about it. You love this game more than you love me. I'm furious. What? If you're feeling jealous and don't really recognize or address it, you might start acting out for attention without even realizing it. Jealousy is sometimes all about insecurity and possessiveness. Hey, Wait, can, can you, you explain, explain that? that? You feel ownership over your partner. You demand things like they're your property. You do not trust them. You don't believe the things they tell you. And you compare yourself to people they interact with. Feelings are never bad or wrong. It is what you decide to do with those feelings, your actions. That choice is what depends on you being a good partner or not, having a loving relationship or not. It is okay to feel jealous. Not okay to make your partner feel bad or lash out or get revenge. I'm talking to you past, Stevie. <laughs> Wait, what? Why not? When you're feeling jealous, invite the feelings in. Sit with them, offer them a cup of tea, and ask them where the fuck they came from. Hey, jealousy, wanna talk? Don't really wanna. Don't care. I I hate tea. You hate everything. True. Sit the fuck down and have some tea. Got any milk? Love is not controlling or terrified or possessive. Long-term love and relationships are built on sharing happiness with each other. And jealousy gets in the way of that if you're going through your booze phone to see who they're texting and thinking about how the person they're texting has a different thighs or a better job than you. So if you irrationally think that your partner is going to leave you because you have negative body image about something specifically, for instance, I'm a big fan of lists. Write a list. Step one, figure out what you're afraid of. So my partner liked a pic of a hottie. I'm obviously furious and now I'm trying to figure out how to kill said hottie. Sick. How are you gonna kill him? My partner doesn't think I'm hot if they also think this Instagram hottie is hot because I don't look like this Instagram hottie. I'm really scared because if they don't think I'm hot then they're gonna leave me. Step two, this is my favorite part. Look at literally why that is dumb. Okay, well, my partner thinks I'm really hot because they tell me all the time. They're not just gonna leave me because they don't think I'm hot, because they love me, duh. I'm projecting my insecurity on them because they don't think I'm not hot. This emotion belongs to me? Step three, laugh at your brain for trying to play tricks on you. 
Yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> and be careful, because I'm so, so guilty of this. Repressing jealousy is bad. Don't push it away. Pull it closer to you and feel it. Examine it. Ask it why it's there. Like, why the fuck are you in my house? And then process it. Ooh, I want to try. I saw my partner hugging someone the other day. It pissed me off because why are they hugging people behind my back? I'm mad. If I'm gonna love you with my entire body and soul, you can't hide things from me. I hate that they're hiding something from me. And I'm also mad that they're trying to make me jealous. It didn't work. Your partner can't make you feel jealous. Those emotions belong to you. Now do the rest of the steps. If they're hiding this from me, what else are they hiding? Well, I guess technically it wasn't behind my back because I was there and they knew I was there, but... So I don't think they were hiding something from me. I was mad because they're hiding something from me, but they're not. I think I'm on edge because my ex cheated on me, convinced me that they didn't, and then did it again. Oh my God, this isn't even related to my partner at all. What the fuck? Wild, isn't it? Be honest about your feelings and talk to your partner. Figure out something together that will help you feel better or recognize the reality of the situation. I need to know my partner likes me. I sit them down and I say, so I'm feeling a little jealous. I don't think it's something you've done, but I need validation. So tell me five things you like about me. Aw, okay, easy. You're fucking brilliant, you're hot, you're so cool. You're fun, you make everyone feel special. You're the kind of person that like walks into a room and people's heads turn, but not because you're hot, it's because of the energy that you fill a room with. You're so good at giving presents. Honesty is my fave because then you get to talk about your feelings and get free compliments. So <laughs> like, Ooh, like compliments. compliments. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video about jealousy. Let me know in the comments if you like the new clone setup. I don't know, y'all like horoscopes? Anyway, I just sent out some boxes to my patrons. I had so much fun putting together the gift boxes that I mail to my Patreon tier that gets gift boxes. Shout out to Casey, Larry, Emily, and Alyssa for being my patrons for so long. I couldn't make these videos without you guys. I'll be putting lipstick marks on a bunch of postcards tonight if you guys want to check that out in the description. And I'll see you guys next time, bye. And it's super hot to be like, hey, uh, we should fuck super hard, but be really. Do you want to come at the same time as your sex partner or partners? Yes. Great. Let me teach you.